Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. My name is Muhammad Arif Zikri bin Suhandi. My matrix number is 053541 and I am from Tesel 3C. So, today I'm going to tell all of you and also my uh, lecturer, Madam Wahida especially, about my opinion on the current situation which is online teaching and learning. What I feel about it. So, the first thing that comes to my mind is that it does affect my life as a university student in two ways which are in a good way and also in a bad way so i will tell you about the good way first so what good about this online teaching and learning is that uh, we as, as as students can uh, communicate better with the lecturer uh, during the online class for example i give you uh, there is an app named Webex that helps the participants to ask questions to the presenter. So, usually we have online classes uh, using this app. So, for me, if I have any questions, I will directly ask the lecturer through the chat section. And it is easier for the lecturer to notice the question and reply directly to me. So, that really helps me a lot. And second one is that I can uh, access uh, assignments and also works that are given by the lecturers easily because we know that most of the students have um, either uh, mobile phones, uh, laptops uh, or uh, computers so that any assignments or works can be accessed through these gadgets. So, for me, I have mobile phones and also laptops so that it really helps me a lot to complete my assignments. So, I think it's easier because I can just uh, submit it uh, through online and does not have to go to uh, anywhere to submit the assignment. So, the second one which uh, from the bad perspective, from uh, the bad uh, perspective of this online teaching and learning is that it can uh, affect my eyes because I cannot really concentrate uh, on the screen for a long period of time because it will hurt my eyes and uh, eventually will cause dizziness and I cannot really focus uh, what is uh, taught in the lesson and also if um, it's not good uh, because uh, if my surrounding is not uh, really good, like noisy uh, or anything, it cannot help me to understand better. For example, when uh, I am uh, learning through the online class through video call and then my family calls me, then I will need to go. And then I will have to stop the online class and then uh, go to my family. This will really... Um, disturb my uh, class and I cannot really catch up what is uh, thought by the lecturer so this is not really good for me and if you ask me whether I like it or not uh, I have two answers uh, which is like and not but I think uh, I like it more because it helps me uh, and I do not really have to spend uh, a lot of money on materials or uh, for assignments um, that is one of the reasons and I like it because it helps me but you know that I do not really like it because it will um, hurt my eyes and I could not really understand it so is it stressful or not uh, yes it is stressful if I have problems uh, like I said if our family calls us uh, I cannot really um, concentrate on the online class so I need to go to them so that really disturbs so I cannot really um, understand about the lesson and it will just uh, completely go on from my head okay so yes it is very very stressful because you need to focus on uh, the screen for a long period of time and if you uh, if you cannot understand uh, about the lesson, you need to directly ask. So, it's like if if the lecturer has uh, rep uh, uh, tell you what uh, 
what you ask them and then when, if you cannot really understand again then it will just uh, make you even harder to understand so it is very stressful stressful for me so how do i adapt so the first thing is i um, usually when i woke up i uh, grab my phone and then i scroll through the messages and uh, go to my uh, group chats of the assignment uh, of the uh, group chats of the lecturers which um, they might send um, links for uh, online class or assignments and <coughs> I adapt it uh, by just staying at my room I uh, most of the time I spend my time in my room because uh, of this online class and I do not really uh, become productive since that so what i wish is that i hope that uh, this uh, online teaching and learning uh, can be slowly uh, put be put away and we should be concentrate more on face-to-face -face communication with lecturers and students because this really helps the students to understand better and i hope that one day uh, we uh, as the students can go back to our university to learn as usual but following the SOP so I hope that will be come true so I think that's for me thank you <laughs>